asleep. Sometimes you think of things. Is this a good thing? Um, that will be determined. My brain is not as smooth as I once thought it was. different with my makeup recently. I'm gonna be using the 3CE tint in a live pink. Really love this one. I'm gonna just blend that out with my fingers. And then today I'm going to layer the Etude House Fixing Tint in 01 Analog Rose. And that is today's makeup. Remember at the beginning of the year when I was like, oh, I don't do makeup, not regularly, and I really wanted to get into it, but I feel so... I know people are going to roll their eyes at this, but I feel late. I feel a little late to the makeup game because I only started getting into it when I was like 22. But I can definitely tell I'm improving, and I'm learning what I like best on my face shape, though I'm still a little puffy and swollen. <laughs> Uh, two vlogs ago, I was designing new stickers for my packaging and to test them out, I just printed them on sticker paper I have here. Designed them with the intention of printing it with my thermal label printer. That way I won't have to, you know, pay for all the ink refills. Because ink is freaking expensive. And these ones already come pre-cut and are roll, so it's perfect. I can just print them out when I print my shipping labels out and I'll have like an infinite supply of these stickers to decorate my packages with. making significant progress. Peacock right now. Anyway, I'm here. Oh my gosh, it's feathering. What the hell? Anyway, um, it's freaking hot. It's it's summer.
I came to take some pictures of my summer sticker sheets in the sun and outdoors, you know, for those summer vibes. It's almost golden hour right now, so I thought it was perfect for that. I wish I brought water. Oh my god, don't don't get my food. Bruh. Shoot. Freaking peacocks, ma'am. I'm heading to meet a friend or an internet friend. She's actually a TikToker and this is my first time meeting her in person. She's visiting LA today. But I can't find anything that's supposed to go in my purse. Like usually I have a compact mirror, or I have some gum. Uh, I do have this hand sanitizer though. And crazy thing is, you know how hand sanitizers or things of the like usually have several years before they expire? I don't know where this came from. The expiration date is actually this month. So how long have I had this for? gotten tickets before. Ah! Why did I just chill in here? I was just watching the queue and I was like, you know, this is normal. I'll just check to see in like an hour. Dude, I literally got them the, the starting price. Oh, but the service fee is like $58. And so it's like, <laughs> whatever. Um, I don't want to look because then I don't want to be like, oh, what should have done this or that? Because like it's already done, you know? Oh my god. <laughs> I got this clear phone case while I was in Korea because I wanted to decorate this with the stickers that I bought. While I was at the market looking for beads, I saw so many booths that had these like felt stickers, few places decorating their phone cases with them. I was like, I'm a sheep. I need to jump on that.
ゃん悪魔の末裔だからいや君たちは誰も悪くないし悪魔なんかじゃないよというかあれが本当きっとどんな結果になっても受け入れられる気がする Just finished the last designs I need for the next shop update. I feel like this week has been very chill compared to my usual weeks. I'm at that point in shop update preparation where I've finished all the designs and I'm just waiting for the manufacturers and for everything to ship to me. This morning I got a notification that one of my products. Shipped out and it should be here next week. But I think I'm also supposed to be getting one today, so I check the tracking like every day, even though it's not gonna come any sooner. But it just makes me so excited. Here's a preview of one of the new stickers. This shop update will be the biggest one I've ever had. I'm gonna have new stickers, I'm gonna have new keychains, new phone grips, new scrunchies, new watches. So yeah, I think I'm pretty ahead, or not ahead, but I think I'm done with. The majority of the work so that's why this week i've just been relaxing a little more than i usually do i've been talking to my friends lately about this and a lot of them are like Annika, how do you not watch shows i don't really watch tv shows that often that's why this week was so weird that i was so into attack on titan i always say i'm more of a youtube watcher because i like having noise on in the background or watching things that I don't really have to pay attention to, especially if it's an anime or a K-drama, something where I need to read the subtitles. I want to be fully invested in consuming that media so I don't miss anything. But a lot of the times I'm like, oh, I can just work on one of my product designs or I need to be doing something with that time. And now that I finished my designs so early in the morning, I'm going to try to pick up bagels today. Hopefully I don't run into the same situation last time where I place an order on online and they don't have all the bagels that I ordered. Still need to figure out why they haven't refunded me for that. This is so exciting if it is what I think it is. I made cereal mods! I found a manufacturer while I was visiting Korea. It took quite some time for them to ship it here once they were finished making the samples. I ordered two different shapes. They're almost the same. I think this one is slightly bigger in terms of how much it can hold. I wasn't sure which style I wanted to sell in my shop. They're both so cute though, like how am I going to decide? I think I'm gonna make a poll on my channel for which style you like best. It will be on my community tab so you can go there and vote. Unless I come to a decision on my own, I will make that style for my cereal mugs. I think I'm leaning more towards this style though. I, I don't know, I like the shape a little better. This is style A and it's the rounder cup. Has a rounded handle. This is style B and this one has a slightly tapered edge at the top. It stands a little taller than this one. The handle is also different. Leaning towards this one because I like how the shape of the logo looks on it. We will see. I, I think they're both really freaking adorable. I actually have another design I was making so there are going to be two different types of cereal cups but I wanted to get the samples of 
the cup base down before I started ordering them. I love these cereal mugs because I use them for mixing things like sauces, whisk eggs in them. You can also use it for literally your cereal or your yogurt. It's wide enough to be a bowl, but then you can still use it as a drinking glass. Like this is so incredibly versatile. It is so gloomy in LA. Literally on Monday, I was like, this sun is here to stay, it's finally summer, and now. How to use them up. No more green onion, but we can't forget the sesame seeds. I'm going 
to meet my friend in about like 20 minutes if the traffic is what I expect it to be. Going to meet up for lunch at I think a Vietnamese place. Let's not be late. I found my gum! And there is my compact. Here's the very simple fit. Brunch? It's not with beer. 